I'm Diane Rogers and I work in the quality department at Maker's Mark Distillery. The purpose of the lab here at Maker's Mark Distillery is all about maintaining the taste profile and the vision that Bill Samuel Sr. created back in the 1950s. One of the challenges that we have is as we continue to grow that we want to stay true to that handcrafted, hands-on experience and stay true to the taste profile. That soft, smooth, sweet, more forward on the tongue with those rich caramel and vanilla flavors. Even though we have a very technical lab here, um, we still rely heavily on our taste panel. Our taste panelist is made up of 25 employees here at Maker's Mark from various departments. They'll come throughout the day to look for those slight differences in those samples that will help give us feedback to the master distiller so that we start the Maker's Mark product with a good foundation. Each year we'll spend some time um, training our taste panelists to pick up on the different aromas of our product. It takes some time to become a bourbon connoisseur. One of the things that Maker's Mark does that helps ensure product consistency is that we rotate our barrels. Barrel rotation is very hands-on and it's very costly because it, it takes so much time. But the importance of that is that it allows our product to age equally well. Some of my hobbies are I love to landscape. I think it's very therapeutic and very rewarding. Um, I also like to garden and the um, majority of my time is spent as being a soccer mom. My husband enjoys um, working on or collecting antique cars. When we get a chance, me and my husband love to take the opportunity to kind of cruise in his old convertible and just relax and enjoy the evenings. These are really his baby, so I don't, I don't get to drive often. <laughs> One of my favorite projects that I've worked on was the creation of the Makers 46. It gave me an opportunity to work closely with Bill. We worked with probably 50 different taste profiles. I grew up here in Kentucky. I always wanted to work in the industry. It's very difficult to get in, and I'm so fortunate that um, I ended up here at Makers Mom.